today we are going to see some other methods of the collector class so far we have completed two set two set two list two map and the collision and this is the two collection uh, this is the count this is the uh, this is the things we have seen so far right so what i'll do uh, let me comment all these things so that we'll, we can proceed with the few others methods right so for that what i'm going to do here is like i am going to work today i'm going to work with the uh, joining method so let me tell you what what do you mean by joining okay so joining uh, will do in the collector class whenever we call the method joining so there are various overloaded methods of joining that i am going to explain so before that let me tell you like what exactly joining method will do what uh, joining method will do like for example we have the list of one two three these are the uh, string elements we have if, if we call uh, we are if we are uh, uh, calling the stream like uh, calling the stream method and then we are collect while collecting we will call the joining then what it will do it will join all the string okay I, I mean to say it will concatenate all the string in the encounter order okay so let me show you the different uh, so joining method joining method okay working with joining method okay this is the this is today we are going to discuss okay let me let me first call list dot stream on the list then we want to collect based on the uh, joining okay we want to collect collectors dot joining joining as you can see joining is having three overloaded methods so i will explain one by one like what we will work with the three methods three overloaded methods and what is the difference and uh, how we are going to use that i am uh, going to show you so let me tell you one thing like why i am taking small small example here uh, my intention here is, here is to uh, familiarize with all the whatever the collector class is there whatever uh, in the collector class whatever the method that is there i am going to explain so that we will be you will be familiar with the all the methods and what is their uh, purpose and how we can use then at the end of this uh, collector class i am going to give you the real time example uh, example as i have already told it before okay so let me work with the joining first okay this is the joining if i directly work with this joining so what it will do it is going to join all the string of the stream okay so sys out then collect if i run then you can see it will it will concatenate all the strings okay as you can see in the output one two three everything in the encounter order it have uh, it have joined okay so now uh, let me let me do all these things let me call let me uh, let me work with the uh, another two overloaded joining methods right so what i'll do i will again create the string dot stream stream dot collect uh, always collector dot two list is coming okay good uh, collectors dot joining okay this time we are going to use uh, I'm going to pass the sum delimiter. For example, this is the string one. I just wanted to, oh, whenever it is it, it is printing, we just wanted to uh, we we just wanted to separate every string with some delimiter. For example, I just want this one delimiter is like underscore, okay, or hyphen. Anything is fine. So if I do that one, then if we print the same if we print uh, the collect one then what it is going to do it will print all the um, it will join all the uh, elements of the list uh, with whatever the delimiter we have passed okay uh, so let me show you by running this as you can see we have seen one underscore two underscore three underscore four underscores uh, like likewise like we have seen uh, with the delimiters right so this is the second example of the second overloaded method with joining okay let me show you the third joining overloaded method okay so let me create every time i am uh, why i am creating each stream otherwise you will get exception so that is why i am every time i am creating the stream 
otherwise we have to use the supplier kind of concept that i have already discussed in the my previous uh, uh, video like how to avoid whenever there is uh, one stream we have opened and we have worked with the same stream if i use the same stream like here it is the collect if i if i use the same stream same stream then it is going to uh, give me some issue right uh, so list of stream if i if i am going to work with that okay so that is uh, make it effort so now, now concentrate the third overloaded uh, method of joining list dot stream then if i call the collect uh, collect collect then collectors dot joining here what i want here is like i just want the string whatever the string will be passed that it will print the delimiter i want and again i want some uh, before that some kind of uh, uh, prefix and uh, ending for example i just want the string should be something like this uh, this is something and here it the string is abc or or i can say a b uh, comma c d something comma separated uh, com comma is the delimiter and this is the prefix and this is the suffix this is how i just wanted to print so that in that case what we can do we can make use of first i will use the delimiter See, this is the delimiter for example i just wanted to this time i just want uh, the separate is colon okay then if i put comma then what is the prefix i just wanted to provide the prefix is nothing but the curly braces opening curly brace is the prefix and and the uh, closing curly brace is the suffix as you can see this is the pre this is the delimiter we are going to provide and this is the prefix and whatever the content we are providing here that is the suffix and like uh, whatever the example i have given live similar way it is going to print okay so let me introduce the local variable local variable and if i go and directly if i run then if i run then you can see see this is the prefix and this is the first first element and this is the second element separated with the uh, delimiter as i have explained this is the three variety of joining method i have shown you okay the first, let me recap the first joining method what it will do it will simply join whatever the elements we have in the encounter encounter order that it will join it will concatenate okay and the second overloaded method of the joining method of the collector class what it will do whatever the delimiter we are going to pass that it will uh, what it will do it will it will separate each and every string of the collection uh, whatever the collection we have based on that it will separate based on the delimiter and third one is we have used the delimiter along with the prefix and suffix whatever the prefix suffix and delimiter will pass uh, accordingly it will uh it is going to uh, collect right so this is how we can work with the delimiter okay that's all for this video we'll meet in the next video there are uh, some uh, other methods are there as part of the collector class that we are going to discuss as part of the next video okay thank you